Hi cuties welcome to our online class today i hope everybody are fine and good i hope you all enjoyed last class can you remember the last topic that we revised yes correct we revised about matter and materials can we recall what we revised the matter from which a thing is made of is called material we can use wood to make chair we can use wax to make candle not only that we we revise properties of materials we can see the material we can feel the material we can measure the materials children today's class we are going to revise about how the different objects allows the light to pass through them did you see the wooden windows when you sitting inside the house the window is closed wooden window is closed you want to see something it's outside you can see children no you can't see you can't see. then you can open the window when you open the window there is one glass windows there from this glass window you can see something outside children yes we can see how you seeing that this the light is passing through them through the glass it's help us to see that outside the things when you traveling in the bus you are sitting inside the bus you are sitting near the window seat you are sitting there you want to look outside you want to see the window is closed can you see anything outside yes we can see how we can see the light is passing through there so we can see the things outside today we are going to revise transparent object translucent object and opaque object you know what is transparent object transparent object is nothing but it's allow the light to pass through them so we can see other things clearly these we call this transparent object when you keep the glass glass tumbler we can keeping there through that you want to see opposite things we can see easily because the light is passed through them we can see easily the other side of the things example pure water when you keep the pure water we can see easily then the glass we can see everything clearly because the light the transparent object allows the light to pass through them next one translucent object these object how it's helping it's helping the light to pass through them but some of the light only it's passing through them so we can't see the things clearly in the transparent object we can see the things clearly but in this translucent object we can't see the things clearly we can see the things but we can't see the things clearly example when you go to hill station and all there is a snow place and all when you see something we can't see clearly this we can call the translucent object next one opaque object this object not do not allow the light to pass through them first one is transparent object it allow the light to pass through them we can see the things clearly second one translucent it sending the light but is not sending full light sending some of the light through the object so we are not seeing the things clearly the third one is a opaque the opaque is not sending the light through them so we cannot see the things through the object through the object we cannot see any things we cannot see example our wooden window when you want to see 
we can't see because that is a opaque object it's not allow the light to pass through them example metal when you keep the metal rod at metal we want to see through them we can't see because the light is not pass through them when the light is pass through them we call that transparent object when is the light is passing only some of the light is pass through them we call that translucent object some of them the light is not allowed to pass do not allow the light to pass that we can call opaque object example for opaque object wood wooden window logs then steel these and all not allow the light to pass through them next we are going to revise about reflection of light children we see the world around us with the help of light how we are seeing this world if the place is dark we can see anything no we can't see anything why because the place is dark when you want to see the things in the world around the things around the world if you want to see the things we want what we want light light where do we get the light children from where we get the light how the world is looking bright how the it's not look dark how we get the light very good it get from the sun sun is giving light for us then only sun is giving light in the night time at home how you getting light through the electric lamp electric light electric bulb from this electric we are getting light from the house these objects that gives off lights are called light source children when the light falls on transparent object it can pass through it but some of the light when it pass on the surface is not good the surface is shining surface is polished sometimes is passed on a opaque object what the light is doing sometimes the light is bounces and come back when is bounces and coming back we call this light a reflection i repeat when the light is passing through it's not passing it's not passing through the transparent object is passing through nicely is passing through so we are calling that transparent object in opaque object like that object when the light is passing but is not passing through it bounces the light it bounces the light that we call that reflection of light we are going to do some book exercise match the following light source light source what children from where we can get sun very good waterproof glass vegetable oil sun metal rain coat what is the correct answer rain coat correct transparent from where we can the light is pass through transparent glass correct translucent vegetable oil opaque metal thank you children hi friends today we revised about transparent translucent and opaque object we learnt we revised also we revised reflection of light children we have finished one term lessons you what you are going to do you can revise that again we are going to write the test thank you children